You made a decoder? Yeah. How did you manage to do that? That's just bits of tin and wires. Because they're a uh, very complex gearing system, I thought. Yeah, it only moves rotors around, and every time you press a key. Yeah. It rewires the machine, and the rotor moves around. 50 billion start positions in it. So, we're going to go walking. We're going to walk forward, four steps. We start with gentlemen the left leg, ladies the right leg. Two steps, show some point, and point, and point. Two steps, three stops, stop, stop, stop. And side together, side, side together, back. Two up the room, two down the room. Clap, your hands clap, 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 clap. Fingers in the air, what do you shout? Five. Lovely, I think we're ready for music. Wait for it. And five, six, seven, eight, four, two, three, four, circle, two, three, four, two steps, two points, point and point, two steps, stop, 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 and side together, back to your partner, two up the room, two down the room, clap hands. This is an important announcement from the event control. Please will you begin to run the whole site in the silence apart from the reenactors and the bands because the gunhead ceremony will take place at 11.
we meet in the presence of God to commit ourselves to work in penitence and faith for reconciliation between the nations, that all people may live together in freedom, justice, and peace. Most merciful God, we confess that we have sinned in thought, word, and deed. We have not loved you with our whole hearts. We have not loved our neighbors as ourselves. In your mercy, forgive what we have been. Help us to amend what we are and direct what we shall be, that we may do justly, love mercy, and walk humbly with you through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. We give thanks today, O Lord, for our nation and its Christian heritage. Make us aware of your faithfulness and of your great love to us in sending Jesus to die for us on the cross. We are aware as we remember those who have paid the ultimate sacrifice. Make us ever thankful for our freedom today. May we be inspired by their faith and devotion to duty, that we may follow your ways, O Lord, and be faithful in our day. Amen. And just a little prayer for the forces. We pray for our serving forces, striving to bring peace in our world. Give wisdom, courage and strength to those who lead our forces and our government. Amen. For God did not send his son into the world to condemn the world, but that the world through him might be saved. So reads God's holy word. It's wonderful to be with you today and um, particularly to see those 1940s costumes. We've been walking through Ramsey and uh, seeing them on display and seeing them modeled as well. And also it's great to see some of the old cars, isn't it? Very often, tragedy and humor go together. My father-in-law used to tell a story about uh, where he lived during the Second World War. There was a, a bombing raid and a number of bombs fell on this area. After a while, the wardens who were inspecting the area went up the road to, to the school. And what had happened was this that a bomb had gone through somebody's roof and it couldn't be found. But it, it had apparently rolled under the bed. And my father-in-law tells the story of these two women, uh, a mother and daughter, walking up the road towards the school where the wardens were carrying the bomb. Little thinking of the consequences. And so you have to laugh even though there's tragedy. In order to receive us, to welcome us, to forgive us if we've been stupid or wrong, and to bring us back home. One of the marvelous things that happens at the end of the war is that the boys and the girls come home. And there's some marvelous and humorous songs about them coming home. But we all have the opportunity to come home, come home to God, come home to our senses. And the opportunity, because, as Eric said, because of the death and resurrection of Jesus, God will welcome us and receive us, forgive us, and give us a brand new start. And that is liberating. That is freedom indeed. So tragedy, but also humor and welcome. We commit ourselves to God we commit ourselves to each other, and we commit ourselves to a needy, sometimes a desperately needy world.
They shall grow not old, as we that are left grow old. Age shall not weary them, nor the years condemn. At the going down of the sun, and in the morning, we will remember them. When you go home, tell them of us and say for your tomorrow, we gave our today. And now may the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit be with you and remain with you and with all whom you love this day and forevermore. Amen. Without members in the same mould as you, Mr Savage, we would not be the membership organisation that we are today. Here you are, Derek. Well done. And thank you on behalf of the Legion. And here you get a certificate as well. So, well done, Derek. Campaign medals for my father. He was in the Second World War. One's Africa, the next one is France, Germany star, and the next star is a uh, military campaign star, and then the next two are forces which everybody got, and next one's are commemoratives, one's armed forces, and the other one, British Service Medal. It keeps me busy.